Microsoft Outlook is often rendered useless because it cannot connect to its Exchange server. Sometimes the fix for this is to simply close and restart Outlook. Sometimes, however, the fix is not quite as obvious, or so it seems. The following tips will vary depending upon which release of Microsoft Windows you are using, so expect to alter the steps to suit your operating system version. Uncheck Offline Mode Sometimes when a client calls and says my email won't work, I find that Outlook was somehow set to offline mode. If you're using Outlook 2007 or earlier, click the File menu. If there's a check mark next to Work Offline, uncheck it and you should be good to go. If you're using Outlook 2010 or higher, follow these steps. Click the Send Receive tab. Locate the Work Offline button. Click the Offline button. At the bottom of your Outlook window, you should see Trying to Connect. If it connects, your problem is resolved. If not, move on to the next solution. This next tip is even easier, and it never surprises me how few people actually remember to try this. Because it's Windows we're dealing with, sometimes the best thing to do is just shut it down and turn it back on. Now, I would first start with Outlook, just close it and restart it. And if that doesn't work, reboot your computer. Sometimes that alone will get you reconnected with Outlook. This next tip involves rebuilding your Outlook PST and OST files. Both are susceptible to errors that can cause connectivity problems. Here's how I handle this. Close Outlook. Open the control panel. Locate the mail icon. In the resulting window, click Data Files. Select your data file from the list and click Open File Location. Locate the data file in question. It will probably have the same name as your email address. If the file has the extension OST, rename the extension to .old. If the file has the extension PST, do nothing at this time. If your data file is a PST, follow these steps to run scan PST on the file. Search for scanpst.exe through Windows Explorer. After you locate the file, double-click to run the application. From the resulting window, click Browse. Locate your PST file. Click Start. Allow the process to complete. After the repair is finished, close Scan PST and reopen Outlook. If you've tried all of these steps and it's still not working, it's probably time that you call your IT department. Yeah, there are other things you can do, but they might be beyond the scope of your training. Anyway, I hope some of these tips have helped you.